For all those of you who are new, my name is Kristen and this is Erdogan Family Adventures, co-starring my sweet puppy, Charlie. Charlie, you wanna say hello to the people? No? Nothing to say. Okay. So, I have been gone for a few days. I haven't been feeling well and thought I needed a couple days off just to relax. I've been suffering with my migraines again as usual, but I'm feeling pretty good today. Woke up not feeling well, but as the day's gone on, I feel much better. But I miss you all. I haven't been doing much of anything other than kind of being lazy, watching um, my favorite show called The, called the Midwife and just taking a little time for me, just so I can feel better. And my constant companion, Charlie here, has been by my side the entire time. Charles, you've been a true blue friend, although you've stolen my blankie. But I hope everybody's been doing well. I've been uh, excited, making um, plans for the next month. I'm really, really happy. Uh, sometime within the next two weeks, I will have all of my new equipment, my lighting, microphones, new camera, the whole nine yards. So I am super excited to be able to give you guys good video, good audio, and just what you guys deserve and what I want to give. I, I don't want to put anything out there that's less than um, perfect or as close to perfect as I can get. So yeah, I did my hair today. I put a little too much of the oil serum in my hair. So now it looks like it's greasy, but I think, uh, I will wait a day and then wash it again and I think my ends will be really good. They already look pretty good. I've been treating them. Of course, I haven't really colored my hair but once. I did that toner a couple weeks ago, which I love. It really kind of evened out my hair color. Um, so my hair is all basically virgin hair that hasn't really been colored except one time. So it's doing good and I'm excited about that. My husband's home today. He took the lead on grocery store shopping earlier while I was down with my headache. And I appreciate him so much for that. He even went to the pharmacy, picked up prescriptions. Um, my daughter's been helping out around the house. So I feel very blessed to have the family I have. Very, very blessed. But um, my husband is taking my daughter to Taekwondo tonight, so I will have a night off. And that'll be good. I'm looking forward to just doing nothing. Absolutely nothing. I don't know what we're gonna do for dinner yet, but that will be after Taekwondo. So yeah, it'll be about 8.30 or so. But it's quiet, isn't it, Charlie? Charlie, isn't it nice and quiet? Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Say hi. Oh, you're a good guard dog for mommy, huh? He certainly is a good do guard dog. I mean, someone could whisper outside and two miles away and he'd hear it and be ready for attack. It's crazy, he weighs all of 10 pounds. And then I have my other attack dog down there who has commandeered the cat bed. You know, cause Chloe has her own little like apartment set up over here, but she took over the cat, cat area. And I'm sure Mittens is thrilled about that, Chloe. They are truly like brothers and sisters. All they do is argue and fight with each other. It's crazy. Like the cat will like stare down Chloe until Chloe gets to the point of like 
severe frustration and Chloe's growling at her, trying to get her to stop barking at her, lunging towards her. It's like the cat just knows how to push Chloe's buttons. Sometimes it's hilarious. Sometimes it's just a real pain in the butt because it goes on and on and on and on. But they are my love puppies and kitties. I love them all. <sighs> what am I gonna do tonight? No. I really don't know. You know, I made the mistake of turning on the news today, which I should never have done. I try to avoid the news at all costs anymore. I mean, the world's gone to you know where in a handbasket. There's nothing I can do at this point other than pray for our country, pray for our world, that things can get better. But for my mental health, I have to not watch it. I, I can't, I just, I can't watch it. So I turned it on today and it's so depressing. So many things going on in the world that just, so not right. And I don't want to get into it because I don't want this channel to be, you know, uh, politics and news and doom and gloom. I'm not a political person at all. Um, in fact, I'm kind of over all the politics and all the the stuff, all the things, um, dead promises. So I just, I live my own life in my own little world and I'm very, very happy in it. Um, I pray that things will get better and that's all I can do as a person. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord and we will maintain peace and happiness within our four walls because I will not have it any other way. And we have achieved that. I miss my kids, my older kids so much, and my grandson. I cannot wait to go see them. I'm hoping in the next month I can make a trip, but we're going to see. We'll see. I have to talk to my son, but um, yeah, life's good for the most part. Life is good. How are things going with you guys? Anything new? Anything else going on that you want to share? I, uh, I really don't have a lot. I hate to say that. But I really don't. It's amazing when you kind of cocoon yourself into your into your home and into yourself and you just kind of take time to, you know, just reset, reset everything in your life and, and just come to this place of peace that there isn't much going on. I love being with my family. I love spending time with my family. I do not see my husband near enough. Um, I miss him so much when he's at work all the time. And he's taking a little nap right now before they go to Taekwondo, so I don't want to disturb him. But, you know, I just love it when we're here together as a unit. Now, we did discuss today a IKEA trip that is going to be happening here in the next few weeks. Um, need to get a desk um, and some other items, some fun items to decorate the house. I need more candles. I love IKEA. I need some new pots and pans in the kitchen. And just love looking around Ikea. I love it. And I always spend so much money when I go in there, but it's so worth it. So worth it. The only problem is you have to build everything, but you know, whatever. But I do need to get some stuff for the kitchen. I need a desk. I want to get some throw pillows. I need new um, glasses. Some of my new Ikea glasses have disappeared. <clears throat> My daughter 
So I need to buy some more of those and probably get some stuff for my grandson and just, you know, have fun. Just have fun. Have to get a new vacuum cleaner. My vacuum cleaner died, so, but we've had that vacuum cleaner, Dyson, for 17 years. 17 years I've had that basin and it's done me well. So we have our robotic vacuum cleaner. I just need to get a stick vacuum, you know, to get like under the bed and under tables and, st and stuff like that where the robot can't get to. But uh, yeah, got lots of things going on, things I need to do. I have a whole wish list of things that I need to accomplish. Um, gonna have some great videos for you guys. Gonna, I have a whole list of adventures that we're gonna be taking and I am putting them in a random name picker, computer program. And each week we're going to do something on that list that the computer chooses that we're going to do. So that'll be exciting. Um, so we won't know from week to week what activity we're doing, but it's going to be a lot of fun. And I'm going to try and have it um, set it up so it's on my husband's day off. So yeah, a lot of neat things coming up. Like I said, I'm going to have all my new equipment, so I'll be ready to go. I just have to learn how to use it all. And yeah, just, you know, really jump deep into this YouTube journey I'm on. I so appreciate all my subscribers, all my supporters. You guys are wonderful. Uh, I, I can't thank you enough for helping me to grow. We are going to have a February giveaway. So stay tuned to hear more about that this week. And yeah just gonna go down that road uh, my husband went to the grocery store today but there wasn't much of a haul he just bought some salmon some tilapia milk just a few things we didn't do a whole lot so there'll be a bigger haul uh, probably towards the end of the week I did a little filming over the weekend so stay tuned for those clips you feel misunderstood Say what's the remedy We'd be like minded if we could But that's not the case Oh, oh, the wind will turn Don't be concerned, oh I can one night off this week. Yeah. yeah. You did good today getting the groceries done. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. The gar garbage out. You did good today. Good. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Good. Well. Shall I ready? Okay. Bye. Good. Lauren, say hi to the people. Have a good class. Bye. Love you guys. Bye. Yes. Quiet 
alone time. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys tonight. I can't thank you enough for being here. I love you all, but Jesus loves you more. Guys, thanks, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Thank you.